Hello everybody, I'm back, this is Duke Potato Nuke, and I'm back with my old buddy Fish Face here. What was that? We're here in the, t in the lovely town of Caldera, because I have decided to move in here into Gorak Manor with all of my orc buddies. Now, of course, this place is filled with a lot of trash. You guys, Argonian. you guys don't keep house very good here, so I'm just gonna have to get rid of all your trash. Thief. And let's see. Oh, they got moon sugar. How nice. Thief. And let's see here. Do do do. Citizen. Hmm. These could be used for something. Let's clear out one of them at least. You think me a fool? Guards! Guards! A thief! And let's see, let's clear out that one. You can't hide, thief! Doop de doo de doop de doo. Yeah, let's clear out all this junk, provided I have room for it. Doop de doo. I wanna leave that there. That's good Guard. Some stuff here. An egg, let's eat it. Surrender yourself! And let's put this candle, a candle in the window, instead of on a crate. That looks good. Doo -doo -doo. And we've got some crates over here. Yeah. Surrender, thief. And more eggs. Oh, and let's just say we put the food items in here, because, you know, we can say that we need stuff to eat every now and then if I can find it all in all this junk. When it comes to what's edible and what's not, I like to just kind of look at the top element, like marshmallow, its top element is restore health, so I like to think that's an edible item, you know, that you use for food, because in Morrowind, even food, like bread, is a, well, it's an alchemical ingredient. But some things like, well, even a trauma root, I guess, if you like eating a thorn, I don't know. Rat meat is obviously nasty, but uh, kagudi hide would obviously be nasty. So with that, even though it's good for speed potions. But let's see, yeah, that'll do for now. What I need to do is get rid of all this, all some of this junk. And look at this trashy bookshelf. How are you supposed to put books on it with all this junk? You take me for a fool. Let's see, all this junk laying around. Surrender yourself! Guards! Such terrible housekeepers. Surrender yourself! Guards! What else here? Doop de do do doop de do. Yeah, let's put a lot of bottles over here, maybe. Let's see. Yeah, there we go. We like to spend the evening around the fire drinking. That one. Can't escape. Can't escape. And what else do we have here? Ah, look at this broom. There we go, that's good. That's more like it. Okay. Let's see if we can set a scroll of some kind here. I left all my other scrolls there. We'll just use one of those. That looks okay. I'll have to go and get my books. But yeah, I want to use Gorak Manor as a kind of a home. Storage, mostly, if you will. But we'll just say I've moved in with my orc buddies. What do you say about that? Got nothing to say? Hmm? What do you think? Hmm? Your wounds are great. What did she say? Your wounds are great? May your kills be quick and many. Okay, well he doesn't mind. Yeah. 
There are many creatures. So we need to go out and sell a bunch of stuff. A bunch of this. Get rid of a bunch of this junk. Not there, because that's a good store. What say you? I need a store where I can just dump junk. And this is a good one. A pawn broker. At least I think that's what this is. Oh, and he doesn't like moon sugar. And of course, he like all merchants, he has x-ray vision and can see through your free. clothing. What do you want? And since he can see through your clothing and your backpack, he can tell what you have, so... I'll just drop it there for the time being. And then we'll sell junk. Let's see here. Don't need that. What the hell do you got that? I'll keep that. What else? What else? And we'll need a tankard or a pitcher. Uh, da, 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 da. Get rid of that. I've got dwarven stuff used for yeah. Let's just get rid of this junk. Well, I want a plate. And we'll need our spoon, I guess. All right, that's good. Gonna keep everything else. Hello. Jeez, these guys are all kind of gathered up in one spot. Traffic jam of cops. So. Oh yeah, there's a bowl I don't care about, but that's alright. Where was that plate? There it is. Is that a plate down there? This is my plate. Your wounds are great. Is that what she keeps saying? Your wounds are great. You think me a fool, God? Doop to do. Let's go set our plate full of food. And a little marshmallow right there. Let's see if I can jump up there without getting stuck. And where was that? Bowl. That's nice and big. There we go. And over here. There's my mug. And I wonder if I've got any flip. I do. There's my drink. And uh, and all that good stuff. Some of that right there. Yeah. But that's essentially what we're going to do here. I'm going to get set up. I wanted to say get set up in Gorak Manor, but the honest truth is just uh, we're going to use it as storage. Here in this, well, this well decorated place, I suppose. But yeah. I was just wanted to show a little bit of that. Hopefully that's not catching, but... I'll be back later on. Alright, I am back. We are still here in Gorak Manor. And, uh... Well, I've kind of arranged a few things. You notice it doesn't look too much different, but... A lot of the beer bottles and stuff are over here. You know, for drinking around the fire. I went to Shink's Shovel here in town, here in Caldera, which is a food place, a food merchant. Got some food uh, set up on the table here. Even bought a fork and a knife from another merchant here. But yeah, a lot of the books that I've found placed on the shelf here. Put a paper lantern up here to kind of give it a nice glow. There's the t demon tanto that we found. Some of the scrolls that we found. Some more, well, a finer drink along with an ancient dwarven goblet. A magical helm. And here's that uh, strange iron sword that I got from the Telvani agents during that Fighter's Guild quest. And, for the most part, there's not, not a whole lot of difference. I'm going to put dwarven artifacts I find here here in this crate. May your battle show only Over here. Victory, Here's where all our food items, you know, we have to store our food somewhere, so... 
just say that we put it there. Put a candle on this sack because this is where I keep my light sources. Over here, I put a ruby on top just to indicate this is where I keep my gems. And going upstairs, I made oh, some uh, soul gems float in the air here. Just to indicate this is where I keep all my soul gems. And a potion, just to indicate this is where my ingredients are for when I want to play around with that. And let's see. Yeah, just a few other odds and ends a little added here and there. But, yep, we are pretty much all set up here in Gorak Manor. So when I start getting overloaded with stuff, I'll keep using... I'll keep using this place for to, uh... Well, just come here and... Store stuff. Store treasures and stuff. Occasionally, eventually this place will get kind of full. So I'll have to... Find yet another location to add to my, uh... Well, general bunch of locations where I keep my stuff. But yeah. Oh yeah. Loot and fat loot. Yeah. So there we are. I'm old Fishface has moved in with the orcs. The orcs and his old buddy Creeper. Up here in Gorak Manor. So, uh, yeah. So next time I pick up, I'll probably have some kind of an adventure or... Oh yes, I already had an idea of what I was going to do. A really good idea. Something that was really interesting. It was a quest I didn't pick, I didn't do... For a number of years, I didn't even touch a particular quest line. A certain faction, if you will. Didn't even touch it for a long time until I finally just did it because I'd done everything else. And had wound up just having a great time with it, so... Yeah, you'll see what I mean when the next video, so... Until then, this is Duke Potato Nuke, and I'm signing off.